So essentially, Beeline Britain is going to be uh, a pretty epic adventure. Uh, it's never been done before, and the idea is we're going to travel from Land's End to John O'Groats, so a really iconic British journey, but we're going to do it in a, in a unique and, and original way, which is in a straight line. This challenge is going to be awesome. It involves sea kayaking, we're going to be on road bikes, mountain bikes, we're going to be on foot. We're going to pass through some of the most beautiful bits of the UK, and it's going to challenge the team uh, to the limit. Uh, I, I can't wait for it, um, but we've got to do the training now, we've got to work hard now and make sure that everything's in place. Beeline Britain is unique. Nobody has done this challenge before. I can't believe it. People have pogo, they've unicycled the Land's End on a great journey. Nobody's done it in a straight line. So for me, it's unique. It's different. It's going to be a blast. It's going to hurt. I'm going to cry. I'm going to laugh. What it's all about. I can't wait. There's a team of four of us in Beeline Britain. Uh, it's made up of Ian O'Grady. Ian's a helicopter winchman in the RAF and Beeline Britain was his idea. We've got Nick Baton, uh, Nick serving in the Royal Engineers and Nick also represented Great Britain in the Paralympics in 2012. Adam Harmer is an outdoor instructor at Placer Brennan and also a lecturer at Liverpool John Moores University. Uh, and my name's Tori, um, I'm an adventurer and a speaker and in 2007 I climbed to the summit of Mount Everest and that's certainly been the highlight of my adventure to date. So with the, with the expert there's two main organisations that we're involved with. Um, firstly there's a charity which we're, we're actually hoping to raise a lot of funds for which is um, a military charity called Blesma, uh, British Limbless Exercise Association. Um, close to my heart they've offered you know, a huge amount of support whilst I've been injured uh, and they do really valuable work with all the other military entities, so a really great call. Uh, and secondly then we've got the, uh, the Royal Foundation which has been set up by Princes William and Harry um, really to showcase the work that, that the British forces do in, in the wider community and in the world. Um, so you know there are a lot of guys and girls out there making sacrifices for this country, you know having injuries that are going to last for the rest of their life. Um, and so what, what the, the World Foundation and Endeavour Fund wants to do is, is really inspire others by what these people are able to achieve. You know, to go out, do crazy things uh, and say, hey, it's all, it's all possible, it doesn't matter about the challenges, let's just go and do something. Uh, so if, that, uh, if, if our trip in any small way can do some of that, then it's good. We are going to be challenged to the limit as a team. But it's not just a team of four of us. There is a huge extended team out there. It's growing, people are excited about it, and we really need you to be a part of it as well. This isn't just going to be the four of us doing it. We need your support to make this happen.